what is going on guys and welcome to html tutorial in this video we're going to continue with our website project you know the one that we have right now so far only one page and the main page over here like this so what we're going to do is we're going to cre create a, another page over here within our website and the page is going to be called production and we're just going to insert the table over here so i have a production page over here and obviously i would need to create the actual file for it so I'm going to go over here and I'm going to say that the file name is going to be production, production, if I could just spell it right, and HTML. So now I can see that I have production HTML. So if I go back to my main page, and if I say that I want my a link to be linked to this page, so I just, within the uh, attribute href, I just place this, the name of the page, right, like we did it before. And over here, if I go to the product, production HTML right now, again, I'm, what I'm going to do over here, I'm just going to use the brackets extension that I've downloaded, install the basic HTML skeleton over here, uh, got get rid of these meta tags, they're not useful right now, and don't worry about this English either, and I'm just going to say production over here, uh, that's going to be the name of our page. And what I'm going to do over here, I'm going to go back again to our main one, and I'm just going to copy some of this, so I don't need to redo it multiple times. I'm just going to copy this, go to production, over here in the body, just paste it, and you can see that now, again, I have uh, three links and actual image over here. And <clears throat> underneath the image, we're just going to create a heading tag over here like this, and we're going to say that this is production, and next we're going to have to create a table over here, right? So the first thing, obviously, when we remember, we would need to create a table element like this. And just for sake of it right away, let's create a style over here. And I'm going to say that it's going to be border. And I'm going to say that this is going to be two pixels solid black. All right. So right away, we can see it, uh, what's happening. I mean, we haven't done anything, but uh, so as we're working, it's right away going to be showing. So the next thing that I want to do over here is uh, just create a little bit more space for us and we would need to start using table rows. And I think I'm just going to use, let's say, somewhere around what, like five rows over here. And I'm just going to copy them, one, two, three, four, five, right now. And we're going to start over here by actually creating a first row is just going to be all table headings anyway. So I have right now a table heading, but I think I copied it a little bit wrong because right now I have way more rows than I wanted to. So let's go back over here and let's start a new line. Let's start this one on a new line and then just copy this one, right? So now we would want, let's say like four of the columns over here. These are gonna be the columns. And over here, I'm just gonna write a rank. That's gonna be the rank for production. The next thing that I'm going to write is what is the country that's doing the production. And then let's say we're going to use the 2015 year. And over here it's going to be 2016. Like this. Something like this. So this is going to be our first row. Right. And then moving along in the next, in the next row over here. Again, I'm just going to create a little bit more space. And I'm going to create a table data over here. And again, I'm just going to copy this four times because this is going to be the countries. But I actually forgot that here I wanted to use a table heading. So the first one is going to be actually table heading over here like this. And here I'm going to write that this is going to be number one. And the rest of it is going to be table data. So I'm going to here write China. And here, let's say I'm just going to come up with some dumb numbers. It's going to be 25 and 30. You can see that the production technically was, uh, let's say, in 2015, there was, they produced 25 tea bags, which is very unrealistic, but uh, just for the sake of doing something, uh, you know, just as an example, it works. So I'm just going to copy this one over here. And what we can do is over here, right away, create a couple of more uh, places we have, well, we, where we have the same information. And the only thing is what we need to change is the data. So here is going to be to India. I'm going to place India and here it's going to be, let's say, it's going to be a little bit less than China. So let's say I'm going to create 25 
and here it's going to be 20. And again, over here, I'm just going to paste this same information. Again, we're well, just going to change it around a little bit. And you can see what I'm doing pre pretty much basically. I'm just creating a table that the next country is going to be Kenya over here. And again, this is going to be 15, let's say 20. And the last country, don't worry, it's going to be the last. You're not going to have to listen for half an hour while I'm just adding these table data over here. And this is going to be number four. And the last thing is, let's say, I don't know, Russia. Right, and we're gonna say that Russia made zero over here, and then in 2016 they just got busy and they made negative one just for the sake of it. So you can see how we actually created a uh, a page, a production page that has actually a very little dumb small table that but it actually serves our purpose for the fact that if we want to show how to add a table. And this would be our article page, again, what we created in the last video. So you can see that slow, slowly but surely we keep adding uh, pages to our web page. Uh, this is going to be it for this video, guys. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next week.